Uh, we're really excited about what's happening in the enterprise productivity segment for the spring launch. Uh, if you look at what we're offering, we're really trying to help our customers optimize on the trends that are happening in the industry. Uh, one is worker shortages, really front and center of everybody's mind. It's harder and harder to employ new people and train them and bring them up to speed. Uh, oil prices are through the roof. Uh, if you look at the last 10 years, it's the highest it's been. Uh, we wanna make sure we can help our customers with that. And the third one is trends, right? Uh, COVID has accelerated these trends in the past two years. And EV is, again, uh, is making a big impact on the industry. Uh, so if you look at our offering, uh, really helping them customers uh, automate some of the workflows at the back end by using, um, you know, uh, intelligence and machine learning in our offering, moving more uh, options to the cloud so that there's less impact on the stores. We're helping customers optimize oil prices by new features that we're adding to the B2C pricing module in our fuel pricing, allowing them to dynamically and quicker change, change prices at the store level. And for EVs, we're offering food services offerings and employee, uh, you know, employee self-service modules. So you can enable them to actually manage more offerings at the store. Okay, so all these features we believe will bring a lot of productivity and value to our customers. Uh, if you look at our uh, retail store manager, it's gonna take all the hardware components and computers out, out of the store. As we, it's gonna be a journey of six to eight months, but we're launching two modules at this point. It will allow you to manage your inventory without having a store and the computer in the store. It will allow our customers to quickly roll out new stores, train new employees, and also have quick updates back in your general ledger as soon as these updates are made. Uh, if you look at the pricing module, it will allow you to optimize your margins really. So as price remains high, and price fluctuates, you wanna make sure you can set a pricing strategy and get it down to your price signs in the store. So that will really help with that. And if you look at the other modules that we're offering, it's really automation uh, in terms of your logistics workflows. You're gonna be automating some of the workflows, making sure that you can optimally assign your loads to the trucks using the, uh, uh, the schedule automation module. And also, if you look at the Carrier Connect that we're launching, again, it'll help you connect to a wide range of carriers so you can basically outsource your loads uh, to different carriers if your uh, in-house carrier either doesn't have the capacity or has the number of drivers you need to make the loads to the store. So if I look at what's coming in the future, uh, really what has been a need in this industry for quite some time is uh, next generation pause solution, uh, which is point of sale. Uh, if you look at the other vendors that are industry are very hardware heavy. And what's happened is the rest of the world has moved on, whereas industry has stayed back because it's just so expensive to upgrade uh, your point of sale. Uh, PDI has lately acquired two companies with the intention of being in the market, providing more value added cloud-based solution that is more hardware agnostic than the rest of the competition. Uh, we have, uh, we, we are currently only international with the solution, so outside of North America, uh, but pretty soon we will be, uh, we are charting our plan to come back, come, come to the U.S. in the next two to three years.